Good morning. So today we're here and we're uh, at the Knoll in Neath and we're going to take our adventures and hopefully have a good day. So today I'm going to do something a bit different. I'm going to compare my camera images with my mobile phone images. So you'll see side by side exactly what I'm taking. Just a little experiment really to see if you can tell the difference between a mobile phone and a camera. I'm using my Fujifilm X-T3 along with my 18135 135 mm lens and I'll also be using my Google Pixel. So compare the images there and see how it goes. And we'll take it out at the end of the day, at the end of the uh, video you'll see the images side by side uh, as you go along probably. So stay with us and we'll see how things go. Enjoy! <laughs> noise in the background because there's some tree felling going on again but uh, this is a nice little area to compare shots so I got my uh, Fuji film as I said there with my 18 to 135 plus of course I got my pixel which I'm using so look at these two shots and see which one you think is which Today is March the 1st, which is St. David's Day here in Wales, so um, as is St. David's Day, we've uh, got plenty of daffodils here, which obviously is our uh, national flower of Wales. So as you can see behind me, all that yellow, daffodils. I get uh, loads of photos of those, which there's loads of my garden as well actually, so uh, there are loads of wild daffodils. So 
So, I'm not getting where I'm going because the floor is rather muddy at the moment. But uh, it's a good day. I've been to the Knoll thousands of times over the years. I lived not far from where we are now. I grew up in this area, so this is my playground. So, um, I'm just wandering around looking for some various things. I've just seen a couple of more hens and various things here, so I'll get some photos of those if I can. But uh, today we've just seen the difference between um, a, a mirrorless camera and obviously um, a phone camera. So hopefully the examples I'm putting up will just make you think about how useful your phone is to use when you're out. Because I know a lot of people don't think of their phone as a proper camera, but of course it's a proper camera. You know, it's uh, it can take a sec exceptional shots. So hopefully you can use your, your phone a bit more when you're out and about, even if it's just for using for compositional use. You know, so you can you can just use it in the future and look at photos you've taken and go back with your camera or even use the photos from your phone and print them there's no excuse these days phones are awesome for uh, taking photographs so there'll be more now and you can see exactly how good phones are these days We're at the end of another day. Um, I've seen quite a few comparison images. So hopefully you can't see the difference, hopefully. You can see how handy a phone is to use, you know? Um, like this, for example, now it's recorded on a mobile phone, so, you know, see the swans there. Wildlife is amazing in this park. Uh, we've got some good day again, as always. In fact, we've got a brilliant day. So we're heading back to the coffee shop now. I hope you can join us next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I hope you enjoyed the video.